Kaboom. Kaboom, ka roasted. That's it. That's probably all the copper that was in here. Oh, no, I found more. Let's see. Oh, Jesus. 2,600 pounds right now. There should be another car there. Yeah, I'm just uh, I'm just shocked at how much we're sitting at. Oh, yeah, that's a lot. There's even as I can get them. <laughs> they both now have 1,300 pounds in them. Easy sauce. I'm having no luck finding anything substantial in here oh as i, as I say that <laughs> i'm having no luck over. finding diamonds at this level <laughs> i think it's time to move on nope nope i can't seem to find any iron here yeah i'm surprised there's no soft scale iron that we can just you know have iron bars but we should be seeing here i think the game is broken <laughs> Annoying. All right, split stack. Probably the easiest way to do that. I'm gonna go back, repair, drop all the extra stuff. Get a bunch of coal in and you want to bring carts back? Yeah. So we're not dragging four million pounds later.
Bazinga. Did you check to see if uh, you needed if you wanted to take any tinder copper that I've already got done? I haven't looked, no. I've no. got uh, 19, 10, 30, 60, 75 copper, and 5 bronze. Nice. Already smelted, so. If you need any of it, have at it. Okay. I think we're about to bring home a uh, crap ton. Well, you know, one or two pieces. A little bit here, a little bit there, a little bit in our underwear. Yeah, so these other copper nodes are just on the other side of this lake. Oh, nice. Easy to get to. I'm gonna grab a little bit more tin because I think tin supply may be a little bit less. Yeah. should respawn right yeah tin response it's actually some of his response since we've been here cool all right well this will be easy this carts hardly weigh anything <laughs> What we need to do is add a crane to it and then put the all season tires on it and then take that out to go pick up the load and then move it part of the way, then drop it, right? Mm. Oh, stop for a sec. There we go. Yeah. Yep. What a beautiful road. I know. It's been thought out, planned well. Whew. Had surveyors come out and lay the lines for me. It was great. We need to definitely pave these roads. Yes. That'd be so cool to have like cobble roads all the way out here with, you know, light posts every so often. Oh, that'd be sweet. We can do cart races. <laughs> Once we get the loop finished, load each cart full of stone, and the best time yeah. wins. Yeah, so the cart raises need to happen on from the top of the mountain. Yes! The yes! 
we're writing the carts down or we're we pulling the carts loaded with stone down pulling the carts loaded with stone down i like it i like it prizes for those that live and a <laughs> grand prize for the person that lives and makes it to the bottom first <laughs> and going down the mountains are no joke in this game no I did it once I haven't been back up to get silver since <laughs> <laughs> This took quite the path. Yeah, it was, uh, I, I, I took like three or four different routes and I found one that worked, I thought the best. And then I had to like pave it out, then go back and, you know, come from the other side and pave it to where it wasn't this giant mound of dirt going through the middle of something. Mm. I wanted to leave the view as unspoiled as possible with my pathing. Yeah. Got my little workbench next to the oak tree. <laughs> Dude, that, that was a lifesaver multiple times. <laughs> I don't even remember why I created Oh, I know why I created it, because I got this far from home and realized I forgot to repair. <laughs> <laughs> and rather than just walk back two minutes back to the house, I just build that. Of course, I had to put in a switchback. Yeah. Because if you don't in this game and you're building a path, do you even path, bro? <laughs> And Weasel cleared out a whole huge area next to his base. Oh, did he? Oh, yeah. Considering it was right up to the side of his building before. I just hit a log with my axe and it disappeared. Wonderful. Watching the skies. <laughs> Watching the skies. Uh, am I full? No. That's weird. I'm not getting the wood from it. It's just... Oh. Oh. It was it was lag. The wood's laying on the road behind me now. Wonderful. Yoinking. This is as if I don't already have enough wood.
Not a bad haul. No. About, what was that, about six minutes back because the elk fear ran out when I was coming down the hill, I think. Oh, I, would, I wasn't paying attention. Still, it's not bad. It's like a six-minute walk back with a laden yeah. cart. Yep. If only there were other people that also could be smelting to help reduce the time. And the work that you did on her base last night, it looks phenomenal. Yeah, thanks. Well done, man. It's all about the... You keep adding wood until it looks okay. <laughs> <clears throat> I think she was happy with it. I think so, too. I can make 10 roofing now. Yay! sleep yeah 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 let me get it loaded all the way an item is preventing you from sleeping <laughs> inconceivable sound like it's going as fast as it used to. No, it doesn't. Yeah, my kiln's still going. Same. It did uh, about 20 of them. Yeah, it only did uh, 15 for me. But it smelted all the metal weird usually it would run all the way out yep <clears throat> used to until this update happened <laughs> So, interesting uh, thing I noticed today, I know there was an update today, but the, the server wasn't paused until I updated anything. Mm -hmm. So, last night, the end of the night, I started fermenting um, the, the potions, the, the stamina and the, the minor healing potions. 
Yeah. And uh, when I logged in today after updating the server, they were not done fermenting yet. Yeah. Meg and I talked about this last night, actually. The server went live Friday, right? Yeah. Given the day night cycles approximately 30 minutes in two days, we would have we would have hit 96 hours or 96 days in game. So by Sunday night, we would have hit 96 days. And we're only we in this 90. We just hit 90 something tonight. Right. So I wonder if the I wonder if the day night cycle. I wonder if the game pauses when nobody's logged into the server. I'm thinking that's what's happening. That said, I logged in today and all my lights were out at my base. Interesting. Because I didn't log in today until late. Mm. Until after I did the update. But all my woods also deteriorated again. Like, since yeah. we left and came back. Which I don't understand. Yeah, I don't know. I actually kind of expect that with the update just coming out. No, there were some updates to the mods as well. The core mod was updated. Okay. Oh, yeah, he did clear that out. Hmm. I think he's looking to expand it. He's going to build a dry dock. videos of people boat racing down the side of a mountain <laughs> how do they get the boat up there that's my question i don't know must be a way to glitch it so that it you can drop a boat on land or do they harpoon it all the way up oh that's possible yeah it's probably more likely actually I think down mountain slides need to happen on the server. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. I sent that grayling sailing. Can't do an emote while in the boat, is what Old Gray is saying. Oh, I was really looking forward to getting onto the front of the the boat and going, I'm the king of the world! Taroo! they're gonna add seeds for birch trees in the future or oak trees i would hope so the oak trees look cool yeah fuck me what'd you do i came up here to get fine wood and look i'm all of a sudden i may have i was hit, i was too heavy i have 15 copper on me <laughs> Oh. Yeah. It's 
the way I roll. <laughs> And I know the world is huge. The exploring the entire thing is virtually impossible. I I would concur. But fine wood is a finite resource. Yes. There's no way to renew it. So if you mined or cut down every single birch tree and every single oak tree in the game, that would be all the fine wood you would ever be allowed to have. <clears throat> Oh, look at the stacks of fine wood on top of the stacks of fine wood. It'd be a lot. You'd make a house out of tables. <laughs> Challenge accepted. <laughs> I like the log house idea, though. Do those logs weather? They do. Uh, they do in water. I haven't really noticed if they do out of water, because usually I have them covered anyway. We see the log houses on the mountains all the time, but that, I don't think the snow weathers. I think it's just a rain. To I you believe so. Noticed. In fact, I can tell you that the logs do weather. Look at the troll outside of Weasel's base when you get the chance. It's all okay. weathered. What the? I just had another disappearing log. Waiting. There's the wood. I think about a little log cabin up here on the hill. Oh, yeah. Just for fun. Why not? In the middle of the boat cemetery thingy. Oh, yeah. I see it's weathered. Yeah. 50%. <clears throat> but if you put a roof on it, it wouldn't weather. Correct. That's got to be a tedious build. Uh, I think once you build one side, it's pretty easy because you can snap to anything once you've placed it. You can't snap logs on top of logs, can you? No, that like, that's, that's what I mean. Like the first side's gonna oh. suck. Oh, I, I see, I see, yeah, yeah. Like, I think I would, I think if I, if I, if I'm actually going to do this, I'm going to intentionally build the first side out of the short logs. Even if it's, you know, only two logs long, I'd rather build it out of six logs first. That way I can make windows and stuff like that a lot easier and then replace them with two part logs once I get it framed out. Screw it. I'm going to build one. Do it. <laughs> 